of my Minecraft ASMR survival world. Now as the sun sets, I want to take a look back at what we built in last episode. So before we take a look at it, if you have not checked out that episode, please do go back and watch it. A link to the playlist with all the previous episodes will be down in the description below. But as you can see, we built this barn. We got this nice barn here that we built. But I still haven't worked out a way for us to get the horse and future horses in and out without getting them stuck here. And without them escaping, obviously. So if anyone has any ideas, please do let me know. But I also want to add in some uh, stained glass panes in these window bits so when morning comes we're gonna go get a little bit more sand and fill that in but guys as you can see i have been grinding off camera i've been doing a lot of work which is why i actually did not post a magic monday video yesterday uh so apologies to those who were uh, anticipating one of them but yes um, there was no Magic Monday video because I was doing a lot of work on the channel maintenance and just working on this Minecraft world. I've been addicted to Minecraft in the past few weeks. And yeah, so let me show you what I have made whilst we stick some of this sand in here. So basically, I have almost completed, I mean there's a little, little error here that I will fix but I have almost completed these stairs as you can see they go all the way up here I've got a nice waterfall that I managed to uh, make work uh, added in a roof as well um, that block should not be there <laughs> I'll have to fix that up somehow uh, but it goes all the way up here we get to here we've got a nice floor view and then it goes back into the side of the mountain up past here an incredible view out to our land then it goes back into the mountain um <clears throat> here we have a little break because we're actually going to build a room in this way so i'll work on that in the future i've got some ideas of what i want to build in here a few auto farms and stuff that i got suggested in the comments of a previous video and then as we get to the top here we're at the top of the mountain would you look at that look at that awesome view from almost every side of our mountain we get an awesome view you can see so many incredible things so i've got so many ideas of things i want to build up here uh, i got some awesome comments of some ideas as well um like some pixel art maybe or a defense tower or a little cottage i think i saw in the comments if you guys have any suggestions of what you want to see me build up there do let me know because i'm open to suggestions from you guys and of course in here let me know what you want to see me build and final thing for what i want to see <clears throat> in the comments is what should i build in this room through here we're gonna build a room through there with a window going out to the other side of the mountain what should i build what should i build what should i build what should i build let me know but for the time being let's stow away a bunch of stuff that we're not going to be using for this episode because as you can tell by the title in this episode we are going to be making some diamond armor so that is right we do have on us also i'm gonna grab all these books you'll see why uh not the ender pearl we're gonna make some diamond armor as you can see we've got 31 diamonds it costs uh 24 diamonds to make a full diamond set eight for the chest plate plus seven for the leggings that's 15 Plus five for helmet, that's 20. And then plus four for the boots, that's 24. <coughs> I'm sorry, I'm losing my voice apparently. But 
Yeah, so we're gonna make a diamond set of armor, which is pretty cool because I've not played Minecraft in a while, and now that I'm getting back into it, it's good to get our armor up to the best tier as it can be. And as you can see, we just got the advancement. Cover me with diamonds. So I'm also gonna grab a couple bits of wheat, actually, or some wheat, I should say, because as you can see, we are level 38, almost level 39, and I wanna do a few enchantments on these armor pieces. So I have been grinding uh, multiple ways to get these levels, and guys, my tips are honestly, although the, um, Zombie spawner design is a very good XP making tactic. The best XP tactics are breeding. So I think we maybe need to do a farming episode soon where we just get loads of animals and make loads of farms to breed the animals because you get so much XP from it. But another good way is just going into the nether and mining quartz. So I've been doing all of that off camera, got a bunch of quartz, been breeding the cows a lot and yeah so we've got a bunch of awesome stuff 39 levels though let's hope this all pays off uh the house coming on quite nicely uh, of course we worked on this room last episode maybe we'll do a bit of a uh, brewing in a future episode uh, but let's grab our glass panes as well uh, well our glass we're going to turn them in to glass panes and actually 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 I want to make some stained glass panes. I want to make them. That's all my quartz. Whoops. <laughs> uh, yeah, you saw I had loads there. I want to grab some bone meal because what I want to do is make them stained white. So I believe what we have to do. What is it like? How do you stain it white? Is it the other way around? I think it might be the other way around. Oh no. You have to make white dye. My apologies. I forgot about that. That is new in Minecraft. So we grab some of that. And then we go like that. No, like that. Yeah, there we go. And 16 for the price of 6. It's so much better than glass itself. So let's pop all that in. Grab some of this and quickly fill in <coughs> the windows of our barn. I apologize that we're doing so much stuff like at the same time, like simultaneously we're working on the barn. At the same time, we're also enchanting and making armor, but we're just sort of getting things done. But yeah, guys, please, please, please give me recommendations of ways I can get this horse in and out with ease and without um, it escaping when I leave it on its own if that makes sense. But let's see, can I reach that back there? Oh, <laughs> we just jumped over the fence onto Marvin, right. Also guys, I think it's time to go get another horse soon as well. So I'll go get one, perhaps this episode, maybe another episode, but there we go. The barn looking all snazzy with its windows. Time to do some enchanting, right, so. Let us dump all these books in here. I uh, do remember we've got this blast protection book, which could be good for an enchantment. <coughs> we've also got two feather falling books, which we could combine to make feather falling four for our boots, potentially. So let's take a look at what we get offered. So on the chest plate, blast protection four, not that nice. We want the protection four or protection three. Fire protection, ah, it's not that great, I tell you. Unbreaking three. We may have to do a level one burner, unless, shall we check what we get on a fishing rod? I think that could be a good idea because I want to do, uh, well, spoilers, but I want to work on a fishing farm in a future episode. So if we could potentially get a very decently enchanted fishing rod, then I'm having a mind blank. What are we getting? There we go. Um, if we get a good 
fishing rod. As you can see, we only have one with lure and unbreaking, so we want luck of the sea. Let's make one of these bad boys <coughs> and see what we get on it. But yeah, as you saw back there, we've got plenty of saddles, which means plenty of... Why isn't that one showing? Would that really get nothing? Well, <laughs> I guess we'll not do the fishing rod then. Instead, we'll just do a book. But you never know, the book could give us a... Ah, no, blast protection. <laughs> Let's just burn one level. A shame we had to do it, but... Because I did a lot of effort to get these levels. Unbreaking three again. Oh. That is no good. Depth Strider 3. That's a potential. I think we'll do the Depth Strider 3. That looks nice. Yes, yeah, screw it. Let's do it. Come on. And fire protection. Ah, it's not the greatest. Not the greatest, but we'll take it. Right, what do we got? Blast protection 4. No, thank you. Protection 4. That is a shout. And unbreaking three fire prod. Nope, nope, nope. So let's do these legs. Protection four. And I'm breaking three. Nice, nice, nice. Protection three. That is a potential. Uh, another protection three. Now we can get prod four. So I think we probably want to go for that. We maybe should have been checking my fishing rod in between and the books. Whoopsie. Ah, well, right, let's just check what we get. Loyalty 3, that's kind of nice if we ever get a trident. Uh, that's not that nice, so let's just do a level 1 burner. It's raining outside, so I apologise if that is loud, but what are we get now? Unbreaking 3. Risky, risky. We maybe should have gone for the prop 3. Riptide, that's pretty cool. Another feather falling 1. The feather falling one book, was it? That could be a very good shout, actually. Luck of the C3. <gasps> we may have to do it, guys. We may have to do it. Let's do it. Let's go luck of the C3. And lure three. Let's go. The very close to being the god fishing rod accidental rhyme is in our possession and now we get protection four so that is another potential and prop four in the helmet as well oh my god things are going really well so let's get potential books to combine um yeah so these ones are potential combine and then you know what I've had a really good idea, actually. Let's make an armor stand. That would be kind of fun. But, issue is, classic me, I'm not too sure how to build it. But I don't think we actually have... I don't think we have the stuff on us right now to build it. Yeah, so what I'm, I'm going to do, I'm going to quickly search up how it's built. And I'll be back in just a second. Okay, so I just searched up the recipe and turns out we need a smooth stone slab and six sticks. So we're going to let that smelt in the meantime. Let's go put this fishing rod next to the other one. Although I wonder how much will it cost to combine them. I guess all we're really doing is adding on breaking. So it shouldn't be too expensive, but what should it be like? 20 levels or something just because it's the god fishing rod but let's see that way 18 levels oh my days we need to get mending on it that's the thing 24 levels that's ridiculous well we know that we need to get mending on it eventually when we do start fishing but let's make this armor stand let's make this armor stand so i believe if i am not incorrect we need a smooth stone slab and then sticks like that. There we go. There we go. And let's put, let's put it like, do you want to put it in the 
this room or in that room. We'll put it in this room and we'll stick it like in the corner here. Yeah, that looks cool. And then we can put another one there eventually. Or do we just want to stick it there now? Now let's stick it here. So let's put on what we've got. So we've got the boots, the leggings, the chest plate, and the helmet. So we've still got to enchant the rest of them. Oh, 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 we've got an Enderman. Perfect. That's another thing I wanted to do this episode. So I want to work on killing Enderman. So if he's not gone, is he actually already teleported? Oh my days. Already. He's already dipped. <sighs> that zombie's got like a shovel. Oh, and he's gone as well. <laughs> Let's go see if there's any more. Um, Enderman, where are you at? And yes, I did see there was a creeper there. I don't know where he's gone now. But let's go kill a dude. And we, are we Enderman hunt? And we may as well kill off some cows while we're at it. See if we can get to level 30. Enchant those boots or something. Uh, doo -doo -doo. Bunch of skeletons, but no Enderman in sight. Of course, there's not as soon as I want them. They're not there. Ah well, we can uh, devote an episode to killing Endermen in the future. I swear, uh, Endermen actually have a high chance of spawning in the, what do you call it, uh, in the nether, so that could be a show. Right, Jesus. <laughs> Look at these guys, just taking the hits. Let's hop in there, pick up some stuff. Bang. 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 Sorry guys. I need my XP. This isn't even going to get us to level 29. We may have to go back to the nether. Tell you what, we'll breed them up one more time, see what that gets us to. And then maybe we can do one more enchant before the end of the episode. And then we'll round it off there. Let's get that off. How do you get off it? Like that. There we go. Right. So, let's grab, um, meant to get our wheat. Our wheat, 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 wheat. We'll grab all of it. Turn it all into wheat. And then, honestly, putting some hay bales in our barn might look kind of cool. We can do that. We can do that in a wee bit. But let's try get this last enchant before the end of the episode. That would be a good way to end off. Here we go, guys. It is lunchtime. Let 
let me know guys is that basically the best chest plate you can get now all we have to do is the helmet but i think we'll do that next episode let's pop away everything in here and that is what we're gonna round it up for this episode i hope you all did enjoy if you did make sure to smash that thumbs up so a thumbs up button <laughs> and don't forget to subscribe for more minecraft videos thanks guys and i'll see you all in the next video good night guys